वेलकम बैक टू द न्यू वीडियो ऑफ क्रिकेट थ्रिक्स रॉबर्ट एमियन बेल क्रॉप बॉर्न ऑन ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ मई नाइनटीन सेवेंटी इन मॉरिस्टन स्वानसी गिलमॉर्गन बेल्स He was a former Welsh cricketer who played international cricket for England. He was an off-spinner bowler who played for Glamorgan and captained the county from 2003 to 2006. He was educated at St John Wyatt's Roman Catholic Comprehensive School. His batting style was right-handed and he was often proved a handy batsman in the lower order. Robert Croft began his sports career as a rugby player when he was 11 years old. But But later he switched to cricket and at the age of 19 he started playing for Glamorgan in his first match he bowled 30 odd overs and Graham Top was his first wicket in 1990 he bagged Glamorgan player of the year award and got this honor one more time in 1992 gradually robert croft became an integral cog in glamorgan's wheels and an england birth came calling when he was handed his test debut against pakistan at oval in august 1996 keeping in view his handy batting talent lower down the order and a well disposed arm ball craft was considered to be more effective in odi he was a regular in the england odi setup until the 1999 world cup the emergence of a certain ashley giles put him on the back burner he made his international debut against pakistan on 22nd august 1996 in a test match at the oval and he took his first wicket when he got amir sohail out overall he finished the game with two wickets for 125 in the same tour on 29th august he got an opportunity to debut in odis as well robert croft did pretty well in his early games and earned a place in the team touring zimbabwe and new zealand there he achieved his test best of 5 for 95 against new zealand and finished the winter season with 8 Eighteen wickets for 340 runs. But his confidence took a battering in 1997, and his career went. The flight and turn virtually vanished, and his best moment came as a batsman when he held South Africa at bay for more than three hours to save the Old Trafford Test in 1998. Robert Kraft tried to reinvent himself in 2000 but his new variation proved to be no more than gimmicks. He did nonetheless play a part in England's success in Sri Lanka, replacing Ian Salisbury and forming an effective partnership with Ashley Giles. But his career was effectively ended when he pulled out of England towards to India in November 2001 because of concerns over safety. Although he was picked to tour Sri Lanka in 2003 and 4 he benched out all three test matches and shortly after returning home he announced his retirement from international cricket to enable him to concentrate full time on the captaincy of his beloved gilmorgan county robert croft did not play much international cricket but his domestic career was always on a high his career best came in 1992 in a match against warwickshire when he took eight wickets for 66 runs of After two years in 1994, he claimed six wickets against Worcestershire, which was his best List A figure. He kept his electrifying performances on the go and became first Welsh cricketer to take the double of 10,000 runs and 1,000 wickets in 2007. On 1st August 2010, he got his first hat-trick against Gloucestershire to help Glamorgan to win the match. It also made him the first Glamorgan spinner to take a hat-trick in 46 years. Robert Croft remained the Morgan's key player throughout his long career of 23 years. Since his debut in 1989, he received several awards as a Glamorgan player, including four player of the year awards in the year of 1996, 2003, 2004, and 2007. His first class and list records are amazing as his international records are average. He has 1175 wickets in in 407 first class matches and 411 wickets in 408 list a games he was decent with the bat too and he has scored 
180 runs in first class cricket. Robert Kraft took the responsibility of Glamorgan captaincy in 2003 and under his leadership his team won the one day league in 2004 and then returned to the division 1 of the championship in the same year. In 2006 county championship Glamorgan won only two games in 15 which was his worst county season as a skipper. He resigned from the captaincy and handed it over to David Hamm. In 2007, he signed a contract extension, admitting that he was in the twilight of his career, but setting himself the goal of reaching 1,000 first-class cricket. His performance barely dimmed and in July 2010, the year he turned 40, he became the first Gilmorgan player to achieve the 1,000 wicket, 10,000 runs double in county cricket on the second day of their county championship clash against Leicestershire at Swansea. He also became the ninth player in the post-war era to reach the landmark in county cricket, joining Trevor Bailey, Tony Brown, Tom Cartwright, Rhea Lingworth, Derek Morgan, John Mortimer, Peter Sansbury, and Fred Timters. He also picked up his first ever hat-trick in that season against Gloucestershire and remained an important part of Kilmorgan's setup in 2011. Robert Kraft played 21 test matches and 50 ODIs for England in his international career. He has captured 49 wickets in his name in test at an average of 37.24 and 45 wickets in ODIs at an average of 38.73. Robert Koch occasionally served Sky Sports as a commentator after his retirement. In 2016, he was also appointed the head coach of Glamorgan. If you like this video, please comment, share and subscribe. Thank you very much.